Gary Wilson, how are you mate? Yeah, good thanks David. That's alright. Now what are you up to these days? Uh, I oversee a couple of farming businesses David. Uh, I grow 250,000 chooks here for Ingham's Enterprises and uh, I'm in partnership with a 850 cow dairy over at Labatouche. So I'm pretty busy overseeing those two businesses. Now you're a courageous player and you copped a lot of heavy knocks but you must have got a lot of satisfaction when you put Jimmy Jess to sleep that day. Yeah, that was a good day, that, David, that day. Uh, the year before, actually, Jimmy cleaned me, off, cleaned me up in the centre square and uh, I missed three weeks with shoulder ligament damage. So the year after, I got the opportunity and uh, Jim was out for eight weeks, I think. He got carried on, off on a stretcher and uh, I got booed the rest of the day. So it was uh, quite a good day. And you kicked 452 goals in your career. You must have loved getting down there kicking a goal. Yeah, I think like most Rovers, David, uh, we, we, we uh, Rovers love to kick a goal. Hungry Barber was around at the time and Lee Matthews uh, kicked plenty of goals and, and I played with Mickey Conlon so when I got the opportunity to get one myself I had to take it because there wasn't too, too many handballs coming from Mickey at the time. And you were one of the first players to wear a helmet. Why was that? Uh, that was at the suggestion of Dr John Fraser, David. Uh, I got knocked out quite a few times uh, in the early part of my career and uh, at about the 10 year mark uh, I was getting blue vision consistently so Dr John Fraser suggested that I, I wear the helmet and uh, I think that probably helped at the end of my career. Finally Gary, in a great 268 game career, you captain your club, won five best and fairest there, played for Victoria 12 times, captain Victoria, Hall of Fame member and Fitzroy Team of the Century vice captain. What's your greatest highlight? As you know, David, uh, you have a lot of highs and lows in a football career and uh, I was lucky enough to have a lot, a lot of highs. But 15 years after I retired to be nominated in that AF AFL Hall of Fame, that was fantastic. And uh, Fitzroy's team of the century to be named vice-captain. Uh, we had a great night at the height there a couple of months ago and for all those die-hard Fitzroy supporters that turned up, it, you know, it was just a great night. Well, you're a little champ and it's great to see you again. Thanks, David.